Hello, everybody. Welcome to Galaxy Odyssey. I know it's been a really friggin' long time, but I got a lot done over Thanksgiving break. And so finally, my friends are back from actually being with their families and actually having friends, and uh, they can join the game. Hey, Beth, how are you? What's up? Hey, you seem currently um, mildly impressed. Give me your impressions. I know a lot's changed around. since last time you were here. Um. Yeah, there's a statue here. Uh, yeah. The thing, a person. Uh, you goggles. can right-click it to access the materials if you want to go ahead and take off those goggles. Oh. Well, well, it's night time, so let's go to bed. Oh, I suppose so. Think. So I have some gifts for you. Oh snap! Snap a Reno, indeed. All right, I'll come back downstairs. Okay, sounds good. So first of all. Um, you're not the it's kind who seems to like to mine a whole lot, so you probably aren't going to need the respirator as much, so I left this for Daniel. Yeah. But if I were to take this off of the statue, come have a look. Where are you? There you are. Yeah. Okay. Look, it's Daniel. <laughs> it's a Daniel statue. We can now make statues. That was the one update that I got excited about. It's the statues mod. Currently, statues mod was not working and uh, I got it from GitHub and tweaked it a little bit so it would start working again. Neat. So now we can make stupid statues. So go hog wild. So, I keep trying to give you, I keep trying to give you gifts and you keep running away. I'm exploring. <laughs> I'll, I'll follow you, I wanna get your impression. A lot of animals over there. Now this was the farm um, that I started making a long time ago. Yeah. And I've added a little bit to it. So yeah. first things first, in this farm, you'll notice that I actually planted your rice. I made the iron shovel necessary to plant rice, so it's right here in front of me. Yay. That's the rice patty. But every time you replant it, you have to have a bucket of water and pour it into the empty patty. That's a little, little annoying. A little annoying, but if you're really clever about it, you can scoop the water out from underneath these planks. Mm-hmm. Cool. Is that the chocobo? Oh, there's uh, several over here. Oh, really? Hey, I found some uh, a feather and rotten flesh. Yum. Well, and hold a on. Torch. I was under the impression that my chocobos died. Uh, that's the sad story. And here suddenly hmm. there are two, so I'm wondering if these are the ones, but they're not because. They don't have the, the tame collar, so I think these are just new chocobos. Yeah, the long story oh. short is I think my chocobos died. Wow. The original one died, and then I replaced her, and the new one died. So I can't figure out why they're dying. <laughs> I'm just a bad chocobo daddy. All right, so what's, uh, what's this dealio? This was supposed to be the chocobo pen, because you'll remember that this is where the chocobo was originally penned in. Oh. So I, I built my first ever redstone contraption if you pull that lever yeah then Ooh. the chocobo can get out huh. but both times i left the server i came back and this pen was empty so my thought is that um my thought is that scorpions got in and killed it oh no but that would imply oh. they've killed these animals too and these animals seem to be okay i don't know maybe they only take mm -hmm. one you're welcome in I mean, clearly I caught a bunch of animals, too. <laughs> <laughs> we have a doorbell. Yep, furs. So, in this chest, there is a um, an ancient helmet and a Promethean helmet that I had Ooh. used previously. Mm -hmm. I've got a new helmet, clearly, so you can take one of those if you want. Okay. The ancient one looks cool. Oh, you have a yeah. thief's cap. Plus 10% speed. I do. Like what? Stuff. Oh, you're wearing that? Yeah. Do I not have a shiny purple head right now? Yeah, you do. I guess it didn't just, it just didn't occur to me. <laughs> I thought that's just how you normally look. Wow. Um, it makes my view a little glowy or you, darker yeah, on the edges. Yeah, you do look, you get used to it, but you do look pretty cool in that actually. It's pretty rad. 
Um, nice. hmm, okay. I'm gonna change this while I've got the chance. Yikes. So, yeah, uh, stuff has happened down here. Lots of stuff, yes. Oh my. Why are there hieroglyphs on the wall? Uh, those <laughs> were tablets that I dug up. This is the, the uh, museum of old tools. I'm like intimidated by all this. Overbound. The only thing I, I asked you don't do is don't punch the skulls because they're extremely fragile and they will not like come off. They'll just be gone. Mm, you okay. have to use a pick if you want to pick, pick them up, but if you just like punch them with your hand, they're gone. Um, the machinery looks intimidating, but in the simplest way possible, this column I'm in front of, the purpose of this is to triple ores. You shove an ore in the top one, and provided mm -hmm. these two switches are on, it will trickle down to cook them into three ingots at the bottom. It doesn't work with absolutely okay. every ore, but most of them it works. Uh, these three on the left, well, the two at the bottom here are power generation. This cube is a battery. Uh, and this thing okay. on top is just metallurgy stuff for my own personal use. It's for making circuitry and shit. Over here is okay. just making basic circuits and compressed plates for very specific usages. I barely come over here. Okay. Uh, the water is clearly for drinking, but the water Oil is actually bucket. involved in the ore tripling chain, so I need to have these devices hooked up to the water source. Why do you have a bunch of oil buckets? Like, where and where did the... Well, actually, where did the oil come from? I struck oil underground while I was digging. I heard some bubbling noise in the wall, and I eventually found a ton of oil. And there's still plenty down there. Huh. Oil can be turned into rocket fuel. This machine <laughs> essentially turns the water into hydrogen and oxygen, and the oxygen gets used in the ore tripling process. Okay. I remember that in our last house machine shop. Yeah. Once this thing gets super advanced, I can I can use the hydrogen as well, but for right now it doesn't get used. This is my archaeology corner. We've got a bunch of analysis machines here, and these are um, uh, essentially fetus fats, so I can regenerate old DNA, but I'm not going to mess with that yet. I think we need a bigger mm -hmm. house before I start really screwing around with it. Hmm. And then this is the treasury, sort of. This is our Fort Knox, where we just keep ingots of metal. How does this work? Uh, if you punch a pile, you'll take one. Mm -hmm. If you crouch punch, you'll take all. Oh. If you right click, you place one. If you crouch right click, you place all. Oh. Okay. So is it like a maximum of eight then? Uh, no, 64. Oh, I see. The bronze. Do you have four? It does okay. eight rows of eight. So Where that's actually these? more than you can compact into a block. These, these are just all various metals that uh, I've had No, to... I mean, like, what are the thing, the tables, I guess? Uh, just to hold them up. Oh, they're, they're, it's I, chiseled are... marble. Okay. So, wait, but you can't just, like, stick blocks on top of, you can't just put ingots on top of normal blocks. Uh, yeah, you can put them on anything. I just put it th on those for, because they look nice. Wait, really? Wait, so yeah. I could stick this on top of, like... You could throw it on the floor. Oh. Nope, it's not a special Welp. surface for any reason. Hmm. I've learned something. What is Oricalcum? Oricalcum is a godlike metal. So, um, something that you really can't ascertain just by glancing at these My is which Dacium. ones are really good for making tools and which ones are good for making machines. But Oricalcum is a high tier metal. This, is it a real metal? Uh, it was actually referenced in ancient literature it was referred to as like it, it's a mythological metal that i think historians think was actually some worked form of copper huh well yeah so essentially well. 
every metal that we're able to make currently, plus a couple mm -hmm. extra, is listed here. And they're listed roughly in strength order from left to right. So they're really... Why is there rotten flesh in here? So... Uh, oh, yeah, I, I was actually going to use this to augment the tool, and I wound up doing that, but I retired the tool. So the best stuff's on the right here. You can put rotten but, flesh course, on a tool. That's gross. If you do the right thing with rotten flesh, you can make <laughs> holy soil, and that makes your mm. weapon deal more damage to undead. And I did that with my spear. Oh, wait, hold on. Is this just a mine down here? What's up? Is this entrance to a mine? Oh yeah, you've never seen this, huh? The last time yeah, you're on the server, that. I was working on this, and you never got a chance to see it. Okay. Yeah. Well, <clears throat> I mean, that's. Fine. This is the way down again. to the mine. Oh, I see the air quality. That's dumb. Yeah, uh, there's no real. The air quality down in the basement and below is just not good. So that's part of why I've been have uh, I've been taking a respirator around. There's a rat up in our eaves here. Yeah, that's normal. No, I'm gonna kill it. That's also normal. Yep. Well, I'm not tall enough to. Alright. I need a block. That's funny. Of dirt. I know I saw dirt. Shoot it. We have a bow and arrow. No, that's, that's lame. Oh, I usually just jump and swing at it. <laughs> well, I tried that. <laughs> oh, well, I guess it's outside now. That works. Yeah, um. That, works that's a better me. plan. I've done it oh, multiple oh, oh. times. I heard it squeak again. Rats just live in the walls. Oh, it's back. Oh. Where? Oh, there it is. All right. Excuse me. All right, rat. Here we go. Eh, I wouldn't worry about it. I'm, I am worried about it. I've declared war on this rat. I think they died. Yeah, that, that sounded real painful. Quick, let's get to I sleep before we get sacked. Go to sleep with a clear mind now. <laughs> rat free. Clear conscience, knowing that I've killed a rat. <laughs> good, good for you. Pink. Cool. Alright, let's go see if I can find the dead rat outside. Yeah, but <laughs> since it's been night for so long, be on the lookout for creepers. Yeah, there are like two over in the field. Uh, there's, yeah. Bunch of shit to the right. On. Yeah, I'm going back in. A lot of things burning out there. I got attacked by two creepers at that very corner. Oh, I just heard a noise. Yeah, it's an enderman. Oh, okay. So, I've been floating no, on gifts for the there. last, like, 15 friggin' minutes. Can I give you these things? Oh, yeah. So you took the, you took your choice of helmet. Good for you. Now, I've got other things. There's XP's out here. I needed them. All right. All right, we're good. <laughs> okay, we good? Attention span back? All right, I'm here. I'm here. I'm all watching. Right, here, me, first of all. Give me stuff. Jesus Christ. <laughs> here you go. Have this. Belt. Sweet. You equip that by so going to either your ordinary inventory or you can press R, I think, is an inventory. But you have to hit Do the naps. Um, you have to hit one of the tabs up top. I think it's the one with the dot. Yeah, I found it. Icon. I have it on. Great. I have it on now. Okay, so that's really easy. Yeah. You press B to swap back and forth. Yeah, swap your I'm hotbar to and from do belt. that now. I'm going to put my sleeping bag and water buckets on my belt. Fabulous. I've been putting food and torches in there, because as long as they're not physically in my hotbar at the moment, I don't get overheated. Oh, I should probably have some torches. Just, yeah, uh, good idea. you know, around. Oh, uh, but wait, there's more. <gasps> I got, I got you something else. <laughs> oh no. boy, oh boy. Even better though, have this. I can see it in your hand. Yes. Knapsack. You equip that on the same tab. Okay, which uh, which key is for knapsack? Um, it's the, unfortunately there's no hotkey straight to it. You've got to go into your inventory and then pick the knapsack tab. Oh, I see. Cool, so I finally can like carry stuff around with me. Yes. So, oh, there's one other subtle thing you might not have noticed. Hmm. So I was making the episodes, I reviewed the footage and saw what you were doing. You were the one who planted these pumpkins. Oh, yeah, I did. I but so. I gave them companions. Good job. Now they won't be lonely. 
That I mean, you say that, but you don't see what the companions are. It's the melons, right? Yes, watermelons. Eek. <laughs> I'm observant. I saw those. A little recognition once in a while. Know what I mean? They're lovely. You have lovely melons, Chris. Thank you. That's all I asked for. 